Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. It is a day after Christmas, but I'm feeling very January 1st-ish, like I'm ready to rage clean, undecorate, go on a diet, do all these things. No, just kidding. I'm not going on a diet. However, I do, I just need to eat healthier. Like I have been living off of sugar and carbs for like the past month with the holiday season, all the cooking and baking, and also I've been living off of charcuterie board cheeses, and I'm just ready to get like some vegetables and fruits in me. So before we get started, I'm gonna make a protein smoothie. Um, Chris ordered bagels for him and the kids. I didn't even want it. That's how you know your body's like, please give me some good nutrients. Like I was just like, oh, that sounds terrible. Like I don't want that. So anyway, gonna make that. Gonna rage clean. Gonna undecorate a little bit. I think this is gonna be like a two-part video because it's gonna be. There's a lot to do. Um, I'm not cleaning where I'm like, oh my gosh, I have to get this done. And like, I can't play with you kids. Like I'm trying to do it like in a chill way, have them help out. They're home for winter break. Evie needs to go down for a nap right now. She's uh, very tired. You can probably hear her fussing in the background. So let's get started. I know I hate when I start off a video and like list all the things that I'm going to do because half the time I get sidetracked and don't finish them or like do different things instead. So we're just going to go with it. And then whatever the title says is what it's going to be. I'll put the correct title, but I might just name it like Rage Cleaning. Do you think people will watch that? Anyway, I said I wasn't going to take down the Christmas decorations the day after Christmas because, you know, the kids will be sad, but the kids are actually ready to take them down too. They're like, can we can we help you? Like, can we take it down too? So um, that's also why it's a two-part video because I have my house decorated from like head to toe. Um, oh my gosh, you okay, Chapel? He just knocked my computer off the bed. I also, I'm like, I can't wait to wash all the blankets. Like, I'm just ready. I hope I keep, like, this momentum because, I'm, like I said, like, I'm ready to put some headphones in and rage clean. Um, and if I get tired, I'll have to get coffee. Also, I have just ordered Instacart, a huge order from Costco. Sorry, I had to restart for a second. So we also did a huge order from Costco. Both Chris and I have the Instacart app on our phone, so like we'll add stuff, and I'll go through and add more. So it's like a collaborative effort, which is nice. Um, we also already had the kids basically um, put all of their things, all the stuff that they got for Christmas, in a bag. All this stuff is not for me. We have Christmas at my mom's house. We have Christmas at my mother-in-law's house. And then we have Christmas here. So it's a lot, so don't judge. I literally ask the kids, I'm like, next year, don't you just want to go on a trip and then that could be your present from mommy and daddy? But no, they want a million toys. So here's like an overview of what the house looks like. And then here's them putting their toys into bags. And this is where we started at because as you could see, it was just a complete disaster with stuff literally everywhere um so yeah groceries coming cleaning and decorating um i also am really excited because i'm going to target i'm finally getting an apple watch mine broke a long time ago it just like wouldn't hold the charge and i was like you know what i don't really need this but i do notice that it definitely inspired me to get some more activity in so that's what i'm mostly excited for my apple watch um but yeah let's get into it starting with a protein smoothie and go from there also, I hope you guys had an amazing holiday. What's all that? It's trash. Oh gosh. Don't be throwing away anything they're gonna be crying about. No, we'll donate the toys. It is trash, right? Okay, so this is just like a triple berry blend. Mommy, help. Mommy, I need help. Hold on, Evie. Okay, so I was saying this smoothie is this triple berry blend. This is from Walmart. Let's see, that was the end of it. This coconut water from Costco. And then this is Truvani protein that I use. Uh, I did just order more from Amazon. Um, so hopefully that comes soon. 
and then spinach. I'm not gonna say spinach. And a rotten banana, basically, because that was all I had left in the fridge. It was completely black on the outside, so hopefully it doesn't taste bad. Delicious. They also just said that they checked out with our Costco order, so that should be here soon. The first thing I'm gonna do is go strip the bed so that we can get all the laundry started. We got a lot of people that live up in here. Anyone else's kids get a bunch of amazing Christmas gifts but are playing with your couch pillows instead? Because same. Alright, my bed is stripped. Now I have to do my laundry too. So I'm just, I basically am just like setting up a line of clothes because Chris's clothes are already in the washer right now. Um, <laughs> do everybody's beds. I'm not gonna wash the Christmas bedding because I always wash it the next year when it comes back from the basement. So, oh, basically just putting all that stuff away. Also gonna uh, put away everybody's. What's their Sorry, to make sure no like underwear is hanging out. Also gonna put away all the Christmas jammies, even though they probably won't fit into them next year. But just doing all that kind of stuff today too. Okay, I hear the dogs going crazy and the kids and groceries are here, so Chris is gonna bring that in. He's also, I heard him downstairs in the player, I'm like, okay, out of all of these purses, Ella, pick two to donate. Like, when we have like a ton of stuff, that's really helpful for your kids. They're not, they're gonna be happier with less stuff, I promise. Um, so, they're kind of going through toys that they're gonna donate to make space for the new stuff that they got to make some other kids really happy. Um, so, our Christmas bins that we usually store stuff in, they have like some random stuff in them right now. So I decided that I'm going to kind of just like make piles and like taking down the upstairs stuff, make piles um, on the rug of like things that make sense together, like banners together, kids room stuff together, things like that, and then get the bin situated and put it in there. So that is next on my list. I'm going to start with my room. Um, the trees I'll probably do last with the kids. It's like very tedious and like. It's funny because I want to take things down to have things be nice and clean, but what makes me want to take it down even more is that the kids are ready to have like a clear space. Um, we will put out some little touches for Valentine's Day, nothing crazy, and not yet. Um, we also have Tanner's birthday parties, which is going to be Sonic themed, so that decor will take up some space when we do that. Um, but it was making me a little emotional, like putting their stuff away. Like so much happens in a year. Um, like what's next Christmas is like and those freaking quotes on Instagram always get me like you only have 18 summers with your kids You only have 18 Christmases. First of all, I used to believe that I don't take any day for granted And you know, I love spending time with my kids and I love them being so little I miss them being even smaller than they are and I know how fast it goes considering I have a seven-year-old um, But that's not true. Be nice to your kids and they will come home for the holidays <laughs> Um, so that's what I that's what I tell myself to make myself feel better anyway when I'm getting emo over here about everything because uh, Time is fleeting so you know I have to get emo at least one time in every single video But anyway, let's start taking some of this stuff down and then I'll show a little Costco haul
technically this train should probably go in the trash because it doesn't like really work very well. Um, but this is so nostalgic. No one who's been here forever will forget how this train got stuck in my hair when the kids, when the boys were really little. And I had to wait until Chris got home to be able to get it out of my hair. Otherwise, I would have to cut a chunk of my hair off. This is literally sitting there. I don't remember which part it was. Maybe this one? Who remembers? But there's literally a train. The, my hair was stuck completely around the, the wheel. And it was a big chunk, too. But I feel like we can't get rid of it, even though it's broken. Okay, so my room, the decorations are taken down, the boys' room, all the beds are stripped. However, I still need to take the decorations out of the girls' room and the girls' bathroom. And I think the boys have a shower curtain up still that needs to come down, but the food is here, so I'm gonna quickly show you what okay, we got. Okay, so I'm gonna show you the frozen and the cold stuff first since I want to put that away. Um, we got a thing of mixed fruit for smoothies, two things of ground turkey, pizza for the kids. They really like this one. These Chris and I are obsessed with. We like to have our chicken burgers on this or like um, scrambled eggs. They're really, really good. We also have milk, coconut water, chicken stock, trash bags. We got some frozen blueberries. We go through these like crazy and Everly loves these as a snack, which is awful because they get everywhere and stain her hands and face, but at least it's healthy, right? These, which Carter already broke into, they are the cheapest at Costco. I also got this coffee. We never had that before, but if it's unsweetened, I'm sure it'll be great because you can just flavor it however you want. I'm probably just going to drink it black. Um, eggs, hummus. This is one of Evie's favorite snacks. Brazil nuts. I was excited that they had these because these are really good for your thyroid and I can never usually find them. Um, so you're supposed to eat two of these a day. These, I don't remember if we've ever tried these before. If the kids don't like them, I know that I would because I love like fruit leather and all that kind of stuff. And then lots of produce. So... Instead of making this pretty, I'm just going to show you. Blackberries, blueberries, butternut squash, grapes, tomatoes. These are mainly for me. I feel like I'm the only one that eats these. I feel like little tomatoes sometimes. Um, strawberries, Brussels sprouts, dates. Now, these are for you can put dates in your smoothies, or you can have these as a snack with some nut butter on them or some chocolate. And then, you know, I always get these from Costco. They're my favorite. The little immunity shots. Got bananas. Cucumbers, peppers, the kids love raw veggies. They don't really like cooked vegetables that much. Um, broccoli, oranges, we've been going through these like crazy, which is great, lots of vitamin C. Avocado, Carter is obsessed with potato rolls, so these are his, basically. Um, sweet potatoes. And then over here, it's another snack that my kids love. And then I got chickpea pasta. The kids, I've tried this with them before. They don't like it at all, but I do. So um, this with some pesto. This recipe looks good in, in itself. I got these because I was out. Collagen peptides. These are nice when you're in a bind. They're organic quinoa and brown rice. They're just like the little pouches that you throw in the microwave. Mango, celery, spinach for smoothies. Apples. Costco has the best apples, you know that. <laughs> they also have the best mangoes. Um, and then these, I showed these before, these are like our favorite lunch to have. Um, the only thing is if you're dairy free, they do have dairy in it, so that's a bummer. We got two packages of those.
thank you for organizing this. Still going strong with the boxes here. Here's the current state of the kitchen. I'm gonna leave it though, because I gotta go finish taking the stuff out of the girls' room um, so that Evie can go for her nap, so we will return to this. Also got a bunch of paper products from Costco that I forgot to show. We were like out of everything, it felt like. what my brain feels like right now. <laughs> I'm not stressed though, I'm happy to be doing it. I just, I'm kind of all over the place right now, but it's all good. We gotta whisper because Evs is taking a nap. I asked Tanner if he wanted to get dressed today, and what did he say? Well, it is with the blank. Yeah, I'm gonna let you guys be bums if you want to. That was one of my favorite things growing up, too. Nice and cozy. <laughs> Chris put his stuff into the dryer, and now I think I'm gonna start with my comforter because that thing takes forever. And then clearly, we have lots of regular laundry. Trash is to empty, it's a whole mess. Also, did I mention that I hosted Christmas yesterday? So that definitely took energy. in the kitchen. Chris is putting the baby to sleep. I have my blanket in the washer. The kitchen is still pretty much a disaster, so I'm gonna work on this before I go ahead and get bins and everything for the Christmas decor and do it down here. But um, after I'm done with kind of like cleaning everything off, I'm gonna go ahead and make this. This looks amazing and I am starving. So this is one pot Thai coconut curry and turkey soup. That's, I just love soup in general, especially in these colder months. And here are the other meals that came with my order. Apricot, almond, and chickpea. That looks amazing. I'm kind of torn between this and the soup. I don't know. I think I'm gonna do the soup. And then I also, this one looks really good as well. This is cha-cha chicken and avocado salad. Literally this, I feel like this order probably is like all of my personal favorite um, like things that I like to eat. This is a very Tiffany style order. Before I can prepare anything, I need to put the dish in the dishwasher. We'll get to the produce later and we need to take care
Okay, so I just finished wiping down the counters and all of that and I put my soup on and I want to thank HelloFresh for sponsoring this portion of today's vlog. Okay, so today we are making that one pot Thai coconut curry turkey soup that I showed you earlier and it came out so good. The house smelled amazing and it was absolutely delicious. But one of the things that I love about HelloFresh is that they can help you eat better amid all the holiday temptations. I talked about how all of the sugar and carbs, I was just completely over it. So HelloFresh can help you eat better. Their meals actually have 20% fewer calories than takeout. So you can still have all the flavor without the guilt. Plus, if you're short on time, you can look for their quick and easy options. Like they even have 20 minute meals and easy cleanup dishes that have lots of flavor, minimal effort. And then you all can relate to this, but this time of year is incredibly busy and hectic, especially with four kids and the holidays. So I love that HelloFresh gives you some of your free time back just by making cooking really simple and easy and quick. I love that all the ingredients come straight to your door. Everything is pre-portioned, so you literally just follow the instructions and have an amazing meal. Also, if you're in a recipe rut, they have over 35 recipes available to choose from each week, so there's definitely something for everyone. You can choose from family-friendly, fit and wholesome, or even veggie. Plus, you can easily customize your meals by swapping proteins or sides or upgrading your proteins or even adding protein to a veggie meal. And I really love that because I feel like the main proteins I eat are like ground turkey, ground chicken, or seafood. I don't really like a lot of beef or pork, so I love that option as well. You can always count on the quality of HelloFresh's meals too because that's their priority. All of their ingredients travel from the farm straight to your home in less than seven days so you know everything is super fresh, which I like. Another great thing is that when you're traveling, like for us, we go back and forth to the Bay House a lot. It's very, very easy to plan for HelloFresh to be delivered to wherever you're at so you can change your preferences, your delivery day, and the address in just a few clicks. So if we need a yummy meal at the Bay House, it's incredibly easy to do so. Again, I just can't recommend HelloFresh enough. As somebody who loves to cook, it's taught me different techniques, different recipes, different flavors that go together. So that's one of my favorite things about it too. We all love when HelloFresh comes. So be sure to check them out. All you have to do is go to HelloFresh.com and use code BEASTINS21 for 21 free meals plus free shipping. Again, just go to HelloFresh.com and use code BEASTINS21 for 21 free meals plus free shipping. So let's go check out the soup. It smells amazing. All you have to do is add some lime juice to it once it's finished and some lime zest on top. It sounds so good and I'm starving and ready to have coffee, but I didn't want to have coffee before eating because that will just ruin my whole appetite. I feel like this would be really good when you have like a cold too. When I have a cold, I'm always trying to get like all the spicy things to like help my congestion or my headaches, but this would be really good for that too. Um, so definitely adding this to the mix. I just got a notification that my watch is ready, but the baby's still sleeping. She's woken up and fell back to sleep a bunch of times, so she needs it. On Christmas Eve, she slept for probably like a total of an hour. I was a complete zombie yesterday. I don't even know how I host it. It was a lot. And plus the kids woke up at 5.40, of course, because they were excited. So anyway, when she wakes up, we're gonna do that. I still have all this produce to prep. Chris and the kids are playing hockey in the basement. Also, I got a couple of new things from Amazon that I wanted to show you because I love all of them and I think you will too. So I'll have to do a little Amazon haul once I get our house together. What do you think, babe? Mine? Yeah, that's your bowl. Carter already had half of his bowl. Ella, what do you think? It's good and it's not hot. It's perfect? It's perfect for like a cold day. That's what I said. I said it's perfect for when you have a cold too because it feels like it's like, you know, the kind of like gets and your sinus is real good, that little bit of spice. Is Tam Man gonna try some? He was excited about it, what's he doing? Fine. <laughs> Look at Carter, such a boss. Now you're showing off. <laughs> it's three o'clock, the baby is still sleeping somehow. <laughs> Guys, what's mommy's favorite drink? What? Hot sauce. Hot sauce is my favorite drink. What's my favorite drink, Tam Man? Coffee. Coffee, Tanner new, coffee time. No, I know coffee. <laughs> so also I want to mention that I'm going to have the recipe down in the description box for this. My amazing, gorgeous husband is putting the dishes in the dishwasher and we have to run it. And then I got to prep this and get our life together. I hope that they hold my watch for us. <laughs> I guess I could go by myself but that would be lonely and sad. Everly, oh, you're bringing all that stuff in the car? My sweetheart is up from her nap and she's ready to go pick up mama's watch. Huh. Also, 
also setting the vacuum cleaner and praying that it'll fix our life down here and that there's nothing on the floor for it to suck up. I already took up the little, oh, it's just saying how I hope there's nothing on the floor. <laughs> it's okay, mama help you. Go ahead, put it back as much as you can, then I'll help you. Um, but I'm saying I picked up the mats off the floor. But anyway, let's go get a watch, I'm excited. You got your snacks ready for the car? I just got potato chips. Oh, so healthy and nutritious. Okay. Dr. Evs, are you ready to go, honey? Oh, brother. Before we go, I just have to say, the other coffee that I used to drink, the other iced coffee I used to drink, um, had added natural flavors. This, first of all, is really good. It's my first time ever having it from Costco. And the ingredients are literally cold pressed coffee, water, and 100% coffee. So that made me happy. It's really good. The lights on because we're in a parking garage. No. Christmas You are amazing. Little tip I said, no bag. And I put it in my pocket and I walked out because I'm not trying to have somebody steal that. And watch right Get now. robbed? Yeah. Was it crazy in there? It's so crazy. That's what I mean. Like, anywhere you are on an escalator, there's like five people right on. How you, did so. you get in and out so quickly? I'm like, Jason Bourne. I don't know who that is. <laughs> Thank you, babe. I'm really excited to get back on my fitness. I did a Target pickup order, but it was taking a little bit too long. I just tried to do it to make our life easier. Um, but. Chris just ran in and said all I needed was some diapers. So that's what he's doing. We ordered some sushi from a new place that's close to Target, so we're excited about that. What else, Pooh Bear? What else do I? What else can we update the vlog about? Um, maybe going to the light show today? They want to go to the light show. I have season passes, so I think there's a couple more days left. But also, wow, you got out of your seat fast. Um, What else? Oh, remember how earlier I told you guys, like, I was waiting to do the trees because they were going to take down the ornaments with me and it was going to be like sentimental and sweet. Like, and guess who doesn't want to do the ornaments? They want me to do it all by myself. Tana. Um, Carter, you want to help me take down the ornaments? Huh? Actually, I want to too. Oh, I would love it if you guys help me take it down. And I rather push in my monkey. Barking at you? Yeah. Honking, you mean? <laughs> A random person honk the horn because we're in a parking lot. It's busy. And she was like, who was that? And I was like, your mom. And she was like, wait, mom, mom? <laughs> your mom? Mama? My mom or your mom? Oh. Okay. I'm just going to take some pennies. You're the sweetest. What are you going to do with pennies? Um. Meanwhile, I'm so excited to have an Apple Watch again. I have it charging. I really like to use it to close my rings. Mommy, your, how much your watch are... should count your steps and all that too. He got a VTech watch for Christmas. Where? It should, Where? It should be in there. I read about it. Okay, well. Let's see. I have some money. I'm showing the box some money. Oh, yeah? I have some money. What's that? Oh, okay. I'm not turning it off yet. It's Ella saying subscribe. Tanner's back there saying hit the bell. You guys are so supportive. I'm so blessed to have such supportive kids. And peace out. And peace out. Okay, let's get sushi. 621. Don't you always love these random pictures that kids take on the Alexa? I do. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and wash our produce. I think I'm only gonna prep some of the peppers and Brussels sprouts, maybe like one cucumber, um, like as far as like cutting wise. So I'm gonna start with that.
So we're upstairs now. Um, Chris is doing the boys' room, making up their bed. I literally just picked up their entire Christmas tree because I'm getting ready to put Evie to bed and I want it officially all the Christmas stuff is out of here. And I was like, I can't just leave the tree till tomorrow. So I picked it up and I put it in the hallway. I'm gonna undecorate it in the hallway, but the things we do to keep our kids on schedule. Um, but Chris already put the unicorn sheets on Ella's bed. Evie already had fresh sheets on. Um, she just has like unicorn fresh sheets on because she needed a sheet change. And I only had one set of Christmas sheets. And then, yeah, just making up this. I can't wait to like deep clean the rooms and all of that. And like the boys want to rearrange their room again, which I'm fine with because I don't really like the layout right now. So all those things to come soon. We also want to do a laundry room makeover this month. Um, so stay tuned for that. You know, we have a very small laundry room. Also, talking about laundry, Chris, there's like a light in the middle of my face. Chris has been like switching the laundry and stuff and doing all that. We did put the sheets on our bed but we're still waiting for like the big blanket but yeah let me go make her bed when the, day turns into night the dryer is really loud in the background but usually I'll do linens in like a giant garbage bag because I never have enough bin space so let's do this these are clean clothes I'm gonna push these into my room <laughs> got lots of folding to do um, clean clothes, For my dirty clothes I still have to do, two minutes left on the washer, and then now, finally gonna put stuff in bins.
kids are downstairs watching something. I know this is the longest video ever, so I'm sorry, but um, Chris is folding right now. We're just trying to get our life back together because we need to go to the Bay House tomorrow because we think um, we're praying that a water pipe didn't break, but we got an alert on our security system that like the temperatures dropped really low. So we're thinking maybe our power went out or heat went out. I don't know. Um, but right now I'm taking down my tree and it's killing me because I want to do everything downstairs, but obviously that would take a lot of time. Um, and it's already 9.30 right now. So yeah, we let the kids stay up late since they're on break. Um, And I'm blinded by the sunshine in your eyes Not thinking twice in my this done Although I know you're all I want How could I crave something so bad? My sweaty palms reveal a warning I should hear But I don't care, you drive me mad I know the truth and run to you Can't help myself. You know too well. So this video isn't incredibly long. I'm going to end it here and do a part two. I think I'm done for the night. I might do a couple more things downstairs, and if I do, I'll include that in the part two. But I still have to go ahead and bathe and edit this and you know just all that stuff. So I wanted to end it. I hope that you all enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up and be sure to check out HelloFresh. I'll have everything linked down in the description box below. Also, one of my goals this year is to reach 700,000 subscribers. So be sure to subscribe. I would greatly appreciate it and tell other people about my channel if they need some motivation to come on over and subscribe. So thank you again. I will see you on So